Keith just said hello in the parking lot here at Deer Creek. Shout out to Keith. Uh, he watches the vlog and he recognized me by my green hat. That's why I bought this green hat. I knew I bought it for some reason because it definitely, you know, sticks out a little bit. All right, I know it's not dark yet. Spare with me. I'm gonna do some running, lots of running, and then we'll get to the lighting of the running trails. We're doing it. Oh man, I just did the new uh, Black Bear Trail and it's epic, it's epic. It's my second time on it. Um, we are at two hours and 27 minutes, averaging about nine, 20 miles. It's seven o'clock, 15.8 miles so far. That ain't bad. And that's all I'm gonna, that's all I got for you. That's all I got for you. All right, I, I came back really for water and water because I I'm not out but I'm getting low and I'm gonna keep going the Sun is still barely up and yes the headlamps are coming out soon but just gotta wait for that Sun to go down so bear with me bear with me Woo. oh man we're oh. PS the leckies they're 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 a game changer how else how else you want to say it how else you want to say it YouTube Getting to be that time where we need the uh, we need the headlamps, but my stomach is giving me the fits. I did pack dinner. Let me pull it out for you. One second. Little Chicago, old Chicago's deep dish. My stomach. I think I just need some like real food instead of Lara bars and uh, whatever else I have here. So and gels. I need like real food. So I'm gonna take a couple bites of this. Hopefully it settles my stomach down. Mm. I think I was low on electrolytes, like couple like I, I feel so much better just even taking like three sips of Gatorade Whew. I feel so much better I'm not giving up on this run folks I'm not giving up <coughs> all right top secret running at night what do I do get yourself a blowtorch get yourself a candle and let's do this wouldn't that be so cool if you were in a race, an ultra race, and there was like 50 people like running down the trail with like lanterns. I wish. For real, what do I use for ultra running at night? I love the Petzl Now. The Petzl Now, I just put it on, boom, just like that. Very easy. The reason I like this headlamp so much is because I can recharge the batteries so easily. Um, it's easy to turn on right here in the front, right there with that knob right there. Hopefully you can see that. It's got these bands on top of your head that actually tighten. Let me see if, let's see. So it's got this band in the back for tightening. Oh man, I love that. And it adjusts on the side here. So you got nice flexibility to point up or down. It's, it's got different settings, you see that? Brighter, you can do flashing, I think, <laughs> somehow. I don't really use the flashing, but you can go brighter, different settings. It's just, I love it. The Petzl now, and uh, 
down below. It's down below. You better believe it's down below. Now this is not a lightweight headlamp. If you're looking for lightweight, I would not recommend this. Like it's not that heavy, I don't think, but it's definitely not the lightest version you can get, but I just love it. So in addition to the Petzl, the other thing I do is this weight waist belt by Ultra Aspire, Ultra Aspire. Uh, hopefully I'm saying that right. And it's this belt here, right here. Oh my gosh, I just, I like this more than the Petzl because it throws so much light right at your feet. And I'm gonna drop the camera down in like five seconds so you can see it on my waist and what it looks like and it's comfortable. It's once again, a little on the heavier side. You can recharge it. You don't need to buy batteries. You recharge it through a USB. And um, I just, and it's got a couple pockets in the, it's got a couple pockets so you can put, you know, car keys or gels or um, all sorts of stuff here in the pocket in the front. Um, so let me put it on for you. So to connect it, connect it like this. Can you even see me? Yeah. So to connect it, go like this. Boom, see it's connected right there. And then you just turn it around, boom. And then you can adjust it down. And then your feet are just covered. I'll show it. So. So those are my two lighting options at night for running. I love it. Both of them are down below. The Petzl now and then the Ultra Aspire. And Lumen 600 is the model of the Ultra Aspire. Once again, it's down below. And I think if you really love good lighting and you wanna make sure you can see where you're, you're stepping at night, I strongly recommend both options because the headlamp is more for you know 10 to 20 feet in front of you. And then the Ultra Aspire is for three to five feet, like boom, right where, you know, right where your feet are landing. All right, let's go, let's go put it through the test. Oh, that was good. All right, time to go home.